what's going on everybody today i'm gonna give you a review of the air max 90 og infrared now they went back to calling it the air max 3 but i've always known it as the air max 90 so i'm gonna be sticking with that but this is one of the um best best colorways of all time to release on the 90 and uh i always wanted this pair i struck out on them when they released um last year but i just hit on a restock and got them for uh, retail and um yeah they're really nice the colorway is um white black cool gray comes in your OG infrared box it comes with a card you got your purple Nike on the bottom That's pretty cool. Yeah, so this shoe is supposed to be as close as to the um, OG pair as you can get. Comes with these um, pretty cool arch uh, supports, which I've never even seen come on a shoe before. It's pretty cool. I'll probably use it because uh, flat feet could help. Air Max 90s. I mean, they're comfortable, but they're not. They're not anything special. Like you don't really want to be spending, you know, too too long on them. I mean, depending on what you're doing, it would be fine. But they're not. The technology is from the 90s, so it's it's just. They're not that comfortable, to be honest. But they look good. I like them. You know, I don't have too many pairs of them, but you know, I always like to uh, to grab the nice ones for retail when I can. Comes with your hang tag. Just a really nice, really clean colorway. Got the um you got the you got the infrared behind the tongue. And I'll go up a half size and um in my Air Max nineties. Air Max 1s, Air Max 95s, I go up a half size because they just seem to fit real snug when I go true to size. Like, I can wear them, it's just, it's not my favorite. So you got the infrared right here, and it looks really good. You got your clear white on, on the bubble. Your bottoms look nice, got the, got the, got the, got the infrared tip black with the with the infrared down the middle it looks good let's talk about quality you have a leather mud guard it's the quality's not bad it's not great it's not bad at all though I've felt worse. You got your Air Max infrared window right here. It looks pretty good. Then here on the swoosh, you have a darker gray suede. That feels pretty good. And then you have your light gray suede that goes um, 
all the way into the middle in the front of the shoe nice soft suede nothing special you know not bad you know like I said for 140 it's really not bad a lot of my shoes are damn near 300 and then you have the light gray on the inside you got your got your infrared soles your insoles got your infrared on the back with, with the Nike Air in black it looks good your white mesh pretty much goes throughout feels pretty good I definitely wanted them for a while and uh I'm glad I finally got them got your got your infrared eyelets on the bottom with your black on top then you got your Nike your Nike Air Max tongue with your white going all the way down yeah I mean that's about it for these I mean it's just a really clean pair really nice pair glad I got them for a retail glad I got the item to do a collection and until until next time y'all have a good one